first we're going to set up to make sure that our lever is going to be in the right place. So we want to put everything that we're going to use onto the arbor press, the base, the cutting mat, the leather, and our die, and adjust down. Mine seems to be right right here. But if you undo these four screws in the front, I always keep mine loose. It makes it just a little bit easier. And you'll see here in a minute when I adjust the shaft up and down, I can realign it to where I get the best leverage that I possibly can. And then you'll see that I bring it forward. I've set it where I want it. And then you just put the four screws back in hand tight. They don't have to be super tight. I find this easier to adjust the bar. There we go, got that adjusted. Now we're in business. All right. Now you see that I'll have a good leverage. I'll use a cheater bar, you'll see it here in a minute. Uh, Texas Custom Dies is who I get most of my dies from. Great people over there. Again, just making sure everything's gonna fit right. I cased the leather, it helps soften it, come back, do my cuts. It's pretty easy to do the cuts with this one ton. Just move it around. I'm using a four inch foot here. We do make a six inch foot that would have made this easier. I just didn't have one on hand. And that cuts it out really nice. Get a perfect cut every time with clicker dies. Here we're gonna go for the second cut. You really need a little bit of leverage for cutting five, six ounce le leather. Just move the mat back a little bit. It's a lot of force going down there. Readjusted. Like I said, cutting with these dies just makes it so much easier than hand cutting everything. Then here's the base going on. 6.5 cutting board that we make. And then here's the foot going on. It's a thumb screw that we use, a quarter 20 thumb screw now. Makes it a little bit easier than the Allen that we used to have. Just hand tighten on, doesn't have to be super tight. It's just a friction fit on there. This is a five, six ounce leather. Again, these are dies from Texas Custom Dies. This one's for a small little wallet for credit cards. There, I'm just checking the height. Thank y'all for joining us. Please like and subscribe. We'll be putting out more content shortly. We have some really cool videos coming up.